Welcome to Bloxy City Weather. Today we are going to track what's what's to become Tropical Storm Madison, and we're also going to track this other disturbance in the uh, ocean um, as well. So let's get into it. So the disturbance right here, this disturbance, has a 40% chance of developing and is moving this way. And this disturbance is now a tropical depression, and tonight it will become a tropical storm, so this is going to become... Tropical Storm Madison. And let's track Tropical Storm Madison. Oh, by the way, we've got this new ridge that just formed off here. So that's why these, are, these systems are going down here. Because normally they would go up north like this. So. Yeah, let's track, it. Let's, let's, uh, track this storm right here. And yeah. So here is Madison. Or what's, what's to become Madison. So this is Madison right now. Just a depression. And, and also, this is a very slow moving system. It's... Not fast, it's just slow moving system. So this is it right now, and then tomorrow it'll be a storm, uh, duh, because tonight it's gonna uh, move here and turn into a storm, and then it's gonna move more down here. But however, before it hits Bloxy, it will turn into a depression. And on top of that, before it hits us, we will actually have kind of a band from what's to become Madison before it hits us. So the, the, this, this, um, this energy, or this, I don't know how to describe it, frontal boundary, whatever, whatever you want to call it, energy band, moisture band, whatever you want to call it, it will hit Bloxy before the storm itself actually hits. So we will have a band of storms moving in before uh, Madison hits. So yeah, we got to watch out for that. So here's a 7 gauge weather forecast. Sorry about that, I had to fix Madison right there. But anyway, here's a 7 gauge weather forecast. So on Friday, we have a chance of an isolated shower storm. Saturday, we got a better chance for showers. Sunday, this, that's, when the, that's when the band moves in. That's when the band of that energy and moisture from Madison will move in. And that, on top of that, will bring a lot of humidity. So um, say goodbye to your low 60s because um, it, there's going to be heat indexes back. So, yes, it's, so instead of 82 degrees, it's going to be like 90 degrees. Um, and then, of course, on Monday, we got an isolated chance for a storm or two with 83 degrees. And then, on Tuesday, that's when Tropical Depression Madison hits. And we will have thunderstorms and showers going on with overcast afternoons because um, there, Madison, is, Madison has a lot of clouds and rain and a lot of it. So that's why we're going to see more clouds than usual with these tropical depressions because normally it would just be scattered showers and storms and that would be it but no madison is actually kind of big and has a lot of clouds and moisture so yeah we're gonna watch out for that and also of course since it's humid it's not gonna feel like it's 80 degrees it's gonna feel more like 90 degrees or maybe even high 80s and we are get we get our um low temperatures back in the 70s because of that moisture is returning so yeah we gotta watch out for that so Tomorrow, I say the shower storm, nothing big a deal. Saturday, 40% scattered showers. Sunday is when the tropical band moves in. And then on Monday, we get some 20% I say the shower storm again. On Tuesday, 60% scattered from Madison. Same, same thing on Wednesday, but 40% scattered. And Thursday, we got 30% isolated for it. All right, so here's your weather forecast.